friends, have you ever wondered what would happen if our planet suddenly stopped spinning? Join Sarah and Johnny on an exciting adventure as they discover the wild and wacky consequences of a motionless Earth. Get ready for a whirlwind of fun facts and mind-bending science. And there you have it, children, our beautiful planet Earth spinning on its axis once every 24 hours. Whoa, Johnny, look at that. The Earth is spinning so fast. Yeah, it's pretty cool, but what would happen if it just stopped? It's a great question, but who could answer something like that? I know. Mr. Thompson, he's always talking about space stuff. Let's go ask him. Great idea. Let's go. Mr. Thompson, Mr. Thompson. Well, hello there, children. What's got you two so excited? We were watching TV, and we saw the Earth spinning, and then we wondered... What would happen if the Earth stopped spinning? My, my. That's quite the question. How about we go on a little imagination adventure to find out? Whoa! Whoa! Welcome to space, children. Now, let's imagine the Earth suddenly stops spinning. <laughs> that sounded like my dad trying to park! <laughs> Indeed. Now, to all our little friends out there, what do you think might happen first if the Earth stopped spinning? Take a moment to think about it. Oh, would we all float away? Great guess, Sarah. But actually, the first thing we'd notice is that our days and nights would become extremely long. Huh? How come? Well, right now, the Earth spins once every 24 hours, giving us day and night. But if it stops spinning... One side of the Earth would have about six months of daylight, and the other side would have six months of darkness. Six months of night. But how would plants grow? And when would we sleep? Excellent questions. Let's explore more consequences. Without the Earth's spin, our atmosphere would change dramatically. those crazy winds. Exactly. The Earth's rotation helps distribute heat around the planet. Without it, some places would become extremely hot and others extremely cold. Brr, I don't like the sound of that. Me neither, Johnny. The jet streams would disappear, leading to extreme weather patterns. What's a jet stream, Mr. Thompson? Great question, Sarah. Jet streams are like rivers of fast-moving air high up in the atmosphere. They help move weather systems around the globe. So, without them, would we have more storms? In some places, yes. Other areas might experience severe droughts. The Earth's spin also affects gravity. If it stopped, Bouncing higher! Whee! This is fun! <laughs> it might seem fun, but it would cause lots of problems. The Earth's gravity would decrease by about 0.3% at the equator. Is that a lot? It doesn't sound like much, but it would be enough to cause issues. Buildings might crack, it would be harder to walk or drive cars and satellites would need to adjust their orbits. A 
Another big problem would be the weakening of Earth's magnetic field. Magnetic field? Like magnets on my fridge? <laughs> Similar, but much bigger. Earth's magnetic field protects us from harmful radiation from the sun. So without it, we'd get sunburned more easily? Much worse than that, I'm afraid. It could damage our electronics, harm satellites, and even affect life on Earth. That sounds scary! It would be quite dangerous, but remember, this is all just a what-if scenario. Wow, Mr. Thompson. I never knew the Earth's spin was so important. Yeah, I'm super glad it keeps on turning. That's right. And there's so much more to learn about our wonderful planet. Why don't we go inside and I'll show you some more cool facts about Earth's rotation. Yes, please! Wasn't that an amazing adventure, children? We learned that if the Earth stopped spinning, our days and nights would become super long. Six months each. Weather patterns would go crazy without our atmosphere spinning. Gravity would change, making things a bit lighter at the equator. And Earth's magnetic field would weaken, leaving us less protected from the sun's radiation. But don't worry. Our Earth will keep on spinning for billions of years to come. If you enjoyed this wild what-if journey, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more exciting adventures with Sarah and Johnny. Share this video with your friends and come up with your own crazy what-if questions. Remember, stay curious and keep exploring the wonders of our world. See you next time and be good. Bye.